and uh, we uh, could see all the players who have uh, come to an end with the preparation and uh, overall it was a good, good preparation for us. Particularly good first half and your three new signings uh, seem to have hit the ground running. They have done well, uh, they integrate well the team, great spirit, uh, good quality as well, you know, uh, Casola, a real midfielder with a good vision, uh, Giroud is a real specialist of centre forward position and Podolski is a versatile striker and uh, so it gives us a lot of uh, options. As you say, Podolski is a versatile striker but he's good at the main bit which is putting the ball in the back of the net, a great finish for that second goal. Yeah, he is a great finisher. You see that in training. He's lethal and uh, doesn't need many chances to, to score. We're at the end of this uh, Germany camp, at the end of the pre-season uh, set-up. Um, how prepared do you feel? Do you feel ready for the new season? Uh, f mentally, we are ready. Uh, physically, uh, we are not completely there. But uh, I believe uh, all the teams have the same problem. And... Uh, Tactically, I think we are all right. You know, we had a good workout uh, this week, and uh, we have a style of play that everybody knows. So we should not be a big problem. Let's see how everybody comes back now because it's international week, and uh, you have always uh, bad surprises in that. And you talked about being mentally prepared. The, the, the team bonding is also important on a trip such as this. How tight is the unit this year? We are, uh, we look uh, very, very tight, you know, the, because we had a good week in Asia, we have a good week here, the whole week we were together and uh, the bonding is uh, good, players uh, are focused, united and uh, you can tell, uh, reply that's always the case <laughs> at the start of the season, but uh, uh, football is difficult enough if you're not united, so if you're united you have a chance. We talked about the three new players coming in. Uh, any more on the horizon? Are you close to bringing in any new players? Still, we are still looking, and uh, we'll see. We, are still, uh, we, we still have an eye on the market, and uh, the two eyes on our team. But uh, you never know. A good opportunity turning up, we still take it. And any update on the Robin Van Persie situation? No, not really. There is no news uh, at the moment uh, on that front. Um, one thing to clarify, uh, have you decided on a captain for next season? Uh, not yet. That will be decided this week as well. You know, uh, uh, at the moment we rotate a little bit. Vermeijen was assistant last year. Uh, Van Persie is still here. So at the moment there is no need to choose another captain. You were here at Cologne last year and uh, obviously our Arsenal didn't have the best start to the season. How do you compare the position you're in this time last year to, to now? We are in a much more solid position because last year uh, we lost uh, Nasri and Fabregas and on top of that we lost Diaby and Wiltshire. Uh, so we lost four players at the start of the season. That's not the case this season. And if you put that right, from, from, from September on last season, Arsenal were very, very competitive at the top of the table. If you put that right, we can compete for honours. We want we have a desire to and uh, we are up for it. Uh, what is the target for us is to come out of the season uh, to feel that we have given our best. I feel last year we did that, finishing in the third position with the start we had. I believe that the team was consistently focused. That's uh, again, uh, the first target is to do as well as we can in every single game and see where we stand at the end of the season. But of course we want to fight for the championship.